Hey everyone, it's me, Howard, We Search in-house vlogger. Welcome back, you guys. Thank you so much for joining me today. We have a very special video for you featuring one of our vloggers, Michelle. Now, before we get into this video, please, you guys, hit our subscribe button, thumbs up this video if you liked it, and please, leave a comment letting us know what you think. We Search is all about finding the perfect product that works for you. Let's see what Michelle found. Hi, Michelle. Hey guys, it's Michelle. So I am one of WeSearch's featured vloggers and I am here to talk to you guys about ColourPop and its new exclusive collection at Sephora. I was so excited to find out that ColourPop is now available in Sephora stores because it is such a great, high quality, affordable brand with a lot of really great colors and just something for everybody. So I went to my local Sephora store and picked out some of their new exclusive holiday gift sets and I just want to swatch them and give my first impressions for you guys. So let's get started. So let's start with the thing I was most excited for, which was the Eurogem Lip Trio, which has three colors in it, which is misbehaving, charming, and catching feelings. These two are ultra satin lips, while this one is an ultra glossy lip, so I'm very excited. I'm gonna start with catching feelings, because this color I'm super drawn to automatically. Ooh, that is a very pretty, basically kind of like a terracotta color. That is a beautiful color right there. And the great thing about the ColourPop Satin Lips is that they are kind of like a matte liquid lipstick, but it doesn't give you that drying feeling. Um, I can already feel that now from my hand and some of the Ultra Satin Lips that I've bought in the past. The next one is Misbehaving, which I'm a little nervous about because this is a pretty bright, purple, but I love plum colors, especially this time of year, so I hope this one is good. Oh, okay. That is actually a beautiful plum color. I think that is gonna look so nice this time of year, especially with a more simple outfit, like maybe something that I'm wearing today. Um, so that is just really pretty. Now this one is gonna be interesting because as you can see, it is full gloss town. Oh, look at that. That is exactly what I thought it was gonna be. You can see it is super glittery and super glossy, so if you're into that, you are going to love this because it really is exactly what it looks like. So I'm going to move on to the eyeshadow palette, and there were a few in this collection. I only picked the one that I really thought was going to work for me the most, and that is Polite AF. I'm already immediately drawn to the packaging, and then you open it up, and it's got six individual shades, that are really in the same color family, so I am super excited about these. So the first Super Shock Ultra Metallic shadow I'm gonna start with is Deep Dive, which is this really pretty, kind of like coppery metallic color. Oh wow, that is beautiful. I could see myself wearing that pretty much all the time. The next one is Drift, which is also another very metallic, kind of like maroon, almost burnt color. It's not as big a color payoff as you might think for a super glittery shadow, but I say if you spray some like MAC Fix Plus or something before putting it on, you're gonna get a huge glitter payoff. This next one is Birthday Girl, which is a little bit lighter than the first one, um, but still more of that copper tone. That is a very pretty one, look at that. It is, as you can see, a lot lighter than this one, way more of a champagne color, so a good one for going out for sure. This next one is Birthday Cake, similar to Birthday Girl, but it's a little bit more on the rose side of copper, so more rose gold than the champagne and kind of gold colors before. That is just beautiful. If you can see it right here, it's super shiny, but it is definitely more of the rose gold um, that some people love, like me. So the next color is Stereo, which is definitely a lot more dark, um, closer to a dark brown glitter. You can definitely tell that one differently from the rest of them. Um, like I said, not a huge color payoff. It's not like bam in your face, which is good for some people and not so good for other people. So that's the great thing about WeSearch is that you kind of can figure these things out beforehand. Also, it looks like the glitter is a little bit more pink, whereas the glitter in the other shadows were more gold, which is a nice touch. The last one in the Play AF collection is Sequin, which is very much very sequiny. Um, a little bit more on the peachy, still on the rose gold, gold champagne color family. That is so beautiful. Oh my God, I love that. So I realized that my swatches were not 100%, so I'm gonna redo them and insert the clip in now so that you can really see how beautiful these shadows are. I'm so, so happy with them. I'm not too much of a glitter person, but I feel like I can definitely work these into my 
eyeshadow routine, which I've been getting a little bit better at. Um, but I'm very happy with these. The last item I picked up from the ColourPop Sephora collection is the Crystal Collection Bundle. First of all, look how pretty that is. That is so pretty. So it comes with a setting spray, a liquid highlighter, and a lip balm, which are very interesting concepts to me, so I'm excited to see how these will look. The main theme of this collection seems to be amber. Um, so the setting spray contains amber, the highlighter contains amber, and the lip balm contains amber, so I guess that's a good thing for you. I'm gonna leave the highlighter for last because I feel like that's the most interesting out of this. Um, but this is the lip balm. Ooh, it's colored. I wonder if this is going to be like this actual color on me because I'm not sure about this. Oh, see, it's not even really colored lip balm, um, which is great because I always need a lip balm, especially it's getting cold and it's getting windy. So this will be very nice to have. So here is the Amber Liquid Highlighter, which let me let you get in on this. Look at that. It's basically liquid gold. <laughs> I'm just gonna do like a small pump on my hand and just kind of see what it's all about. Come on. Whoa. Oh my goodness, look at that. It is thick. I'll start with that. A lot thicker than I thought. I don't know if I put too much, but that's wild. It's almost kind of like liquid chalk. So once I kind of blend it in a little bit more, you can see it. I think this would be really nice if you like the dewy look to put in like a foundation or moisturizer um, because it will really give you a nice natural glow. Like see, that's not even like that intense, um, but it's beautiful. I think that looks so pretty. Maybe I'll just put some on my highlighter right now. Look at that. That is a glow if I've ever seen one. So here is the setting spray, glass bottle, which is very nice. Um, and I've already done my makeup and not applied my setting spray, so I'm gonna try this out. It's a little bit harsher of a spray than maybe like the Urban Decay All Night spray. Ooh, that smells delicious. I'm very happy with this. So that is everything I picked up from Sephora's ColourPop collection. Let me know in the comments, what have you been liking? Have you picked up any of the items? Are any of the items your favorites? What other holiday collections are you excited to come out? Because there are gonna be so many. If you wanna check out more from me, my channel and my social media links are all in the description. I hope you guys have an amazing day. I love you lots and I'll see you next time. Happy searching, bye. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Oh my goodness, Michelle, that was awesome and I have got to get those sparkly ones you guys if you like this video please make sure you hit our subscribe button and thumbs up this video and definitely leave a comment make sure you check out WeSearch.com and just to let you know we have new videos that are gonna be coming out every Tuesday and Thursday so stay tuned you guys make sure you follow we search Michelle and I on social media there are links to all of us right in the description and we'll see you next time bye